Hey, it's Aran here. Welcome to a tech tutorial on Searchy.io. And I wanted to show you the exact login process. So when you are sending access to your students, I want you to see what is the user experience like. Now I'm going to show you an example in a membership that I'm personally a part of, which is Amy Porterfield's membership, Momentum. And this is not an endorsement to Momentum. I just signed up to test it out and see if I like it or not. But because she's using Searchy, I figured it's a good opportunity for me to actually show you the user experience. So let me share my screen. This is when you click on the link from the email, which I'll show you the email as well. I'll put, post it up right here on the screen. This is what the email looks like. And now once you click on the email, you'll see that you have these things right here. And you can see the powered by Searchy. I'm assuming that's removable, although I'm not 100% sure. She's obviously incentivized not to remove it because you can see that the link there on the bottom left is her affiliate link. So she doesn't remove it. Obviously, I probably wouldn't remove it either for the same purpose. So this is the, the logo. Here you have a question option, which I believe this is something that she has installed. This is a different software completely where you can see that this is something she's created. This is not part of Searchy. This is its own separate software. And she's using uh, something called Help Scout, which again, you can see if you look at the bottom left, you can see this is also an affiliate link. Now here, what you do as a new member to a membership with Searchy, you would be asked to upload an image. So you would click on upload and then I'm just going to find a photo of me. Okay. So here's a photo of me. I'll upload it. You see that there is the maximum size, which could be a little bit annoying because maybe it's not going to let me upload certain things. So let's just see if it doesn't let me upload certain things. Like I'll, I'll pick a photo, which is a lot larger and see if that's going to be an issue. Okay, you see that it actually worked just fine. No problem at all. So that's good. Name, uh, first name, last name. Now I'm going to click on continue. Now it's going to ask me to set up a password. Now I use LastPass, which you can see somewhere around here. There's going to be a video for my LastPass training. So you can check it out. So you just basically pick the password that you want. Copy, paste it in, paste it in, click on continue. Now I'm going to save this. Now it asks me for member directory. So add your information below to add it to our member directory. Excellent way to connect with new members. Title, I'll just call myself online entrepreneur. Short bio, what do you do? I help people with the tech side of launching and growing an online business. I make technology less overwhelming four people. Okay. So this is entrepreneurship, membership, subscription, tech, online marketing, coaching, consulting. Yeah. Blogger, vlogger, I guess so. Yep. Yeah. And also YouTuber, but good enough. Course title, landing page challenge. That's good. They're actually giving you an option to add your information. Let me add the link. Course description. This is a hybrid between a course and a service where I provide you with a step-by-step -step checklist and tutorials on getting your landing page done along with your lead magnet funnel from A to Z completely for free, but with the option to have me and my team actually to have it done for you. There you go. Which country do you live in? I mean, I'll just say Australia right now, even though I'm moving. Okay. I don't live in the U S currently looking for, um, none of that really. Accountability pod, how to contact me, lead magnet link. I'll give them this one. Facebook profile. I'll give them my Facebook group, Instagram. I'll give them this link, LinkedIn. Podcast link. I'll give them my YouTube. I'll give them my affiliate marketing podcast. Hey, hey. 
blog link. Okay, that's a good that's a good thing for me to do. Let me just grab the link for a blog. This is a really good blog, but they're going to be they they're gonna like this one. And also a round dot link forward slash course blog. YouTube. I'm gonna give them this link. TikTok. Sure, I'll give them my TikTok. Okay. Online community. Okay. Dot com truths group. And let me just grab facebook.arambukai.com like that. I'll replace the Facebook one. Membership link. Yep. Email list size, 4,000 plus. Number of launches, I don't know. Hard to say, I mean, that's so many launches, I'm not sure. Okay, good enough. Uh, lead magnets link, website link. I'm gonna give them this link for my website. Cool, all right. Continue. Oh. Okay, so now this is user guiding. Note that this is a tool that is not searchy. This is different, okay? So this is something for making things, making onboarding uh, things done. So just be aware of that. Search across the entire momentum by keyword. Find the main navigation, use to find content. Okay, that's a cool little, little thing. Click to update your profile, change your password. Find key resources like monthly calendar, access to your Facebook community. Okay. Cool. All right, that's good. Now you'll see here, oh, there you go. Revisit the checklist. Okay, yeah, got it. Okay, now there's a video, nice. Note that this whole thing, the video is on Searchy, but this onboarding thing again is using this user guiding tool. Let me get another video. What to expect, that's good. Community overview, Facebook group, take the tour. Okay, so he's taking the tour again. So basically here I can go through and gives you me, me the onboarding. It's very good, very, very good. This part is again the support ticketing aspect. This is to get started, they've got an assessment. I mean, this is all searchy set up in its own way. So yeah, this is, this is all um, content that is like the community hub basically. So anyway, very good. Like if you click on Q and A's with Amy, it will take you to all the Q and A's for example. So, you know, that's how you can kind of set up different things. So this is all customizable, but yeah, it's pretty good. Pretty good. So this is Searchy. This is the user experience. Hope you get value from this video. If you have any questions, let me know. If you want to check out Searchy, then all you got to do is go to aran.link forward slash Searchy and check it out. This link is, is my affiliate link. You can learn more about it by going there. Sign up for a free trial. If you have any questions, you're welcome to book a call with me to get help and uh, discuss the software. If you have any questions, things along these lines. And of course, I do offer bonuses for those that do sign up using my affiliate link. If you're interested, you could just let me know. Send me an email to contact at Let me know you sign up using my link. I'll make sure that it is, I did get credit and I'll give you my bonuses. That's about it. I'll speak to you soon.